Hi guys, bonjour, hola, my name is Trish. If you're new, welcome. In this short tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a displacement map. The first thing we are going to do is to apply a black and white adjustment. So click on your adjustment levels and choose black and white. Now we are going to make a selection of both layers, right click and convert this into a smart object. Now, the second thing we want to do is to apply a blur effect. So go to filter blur and then choose Gaussian blur. Now we want to make sure that we use a 1% radius. Go ahead and click OK. We're going to right click on the layer and convert this also into a smart object. Now right click and make a duplicate and we want to create a new layer, a new document. So click on new and type in displacement and we are going to go ahead to click OK. Now Photoshop will open another window with the final image that we've created. So now we are going to create, we are going to go ahead to save it. So go to file, save as and look for the location where you want to save your file and go ahead and just save it. So once we have it saved, we are going to close out of this. You don't need to save it. Now we are back on the original. We are going to go back. So control Z to go back a couple of times. So the next thing we're going to do is we are going to bring in the image that we want to infuse on the brick. Now I'll make this available for you to practice. So once we have it in here, so we're going to zoom out and we are going to go ahead and scale this and set it in place like that. So from here, what we want to do is that we want to click on our layer, go to filter, go to distort and choose displacement. And we want to go ahead and set both our horizontal and vertical scales to three and go ahead and click OK and Photoshop will allow you to find the file and it's a PSD file, double click on the file so we can infuse it. So the next thing we're going to do is that we are going to make a duplicate of this file, three versions. So command J, command J to make three copies. Now we're going to click on the bottom layer and we are going to change this to screen. And we are going to go ahead and change adjustments to screen. And then we are going to double click on the middle one, change, rename it to color. And we are going to change the adjustment levels to color. We will double click on the top one and this will be multiply. We're going to change the adjustment level to multiply on this one. Now I'm going to go ahead and turn off these other two and we are going to double click on this and it will pull up the layer style. Now we want to hold down option or alt if you are on the windows and we want to split the bottom um, and then we want to slide it towards the middle about this much. Click OK. Now turn on the second layer which is the color double click to bring up the layer style, hold down options and repeat the same thing halfway. We're going to go ahead to click OK. Now turn on the top one, double click. Now this time we hold down shift, but we split it from the opposite side and we do something like this. You can extend it a little more to get all the texture of the brick showing up in your image. Go ahead and click OK. So guys, this brings us to the end of this tutorial. Please like, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next tutorial. Bye, y'all.